Hello YouTube viewers. If you guys are watching this, it is probably because you guys are having issues in rendering on Sony Vegas. Well, I did too, um, and it was extremely annoying because I was working on a Macbeth project for my friends, and there was like 10 people in the group, and I had finished the whole video, but when I was rendering it, around like 28% done on the rendering, all of a sudden this error occurred saying, um, an error occurred writing the file. Make sure you have right access to the file slash folder and that there is enough free space. I was really, really annoyed and confused when this occurred. I had like no idea what was going on, so I kept trying to render it. And I was rendering it in AIV file format, so I mean, it was the right format. Uh, it was just really, it was just really annoying because it would not format, and the due date for my friends was coming up. So I searched online and uh, with the help of a website on there and then a lot of just uh, prodding and poking around and investigating on Sony Vegas and on my computer I figured out the issue to this error and I'm pretty sure that uh, this error is pretty much linked to exactly what I'm going to teach you guys how to fix so pretty much I believe that uh, my method will probably get rid of this error for um, all of your guys' issues. Um, you guys probably all have a similar issue to mine, though, as you will see. So, um, <clears throat> what I found out, if you go to File, and then if you go to Render As, then your rendering thing will pop up. And then um, up here is where your video is. And then if you click Browse, and then you go down to Computer, you will see your hard drives or hard drive. Uh, I don't know how many hard drives you guys have. You guys have. Um, I have two. Um, it doesn't really matter. I mean, it'd make it easier if you guys have multiple hard drives. But if you just if you just have one hard drive, that's perfectly fine. This will still easily work. What I found out was, as you can see, my local disk <laughs> only has like like less than two gigabytes of data left on it. And actually, when you render a video, it takes up a ton of room. Uh, it's a it's a huge amount of memory. So what I found out was when I was rendering it, this the video I was rendering was over two. It was a little over two and a half gigabytes worth of memory, and I had it. I had it um trying to render in my local disk. So I finally found out that um just to resolve this issue, I just went to my backup disk, which had over a hundred gigabytes worth of data, and then I rendered it and it turned out perfectly fine and it rendered all the way through I didn't have an issue so to resolve this issue for you guys um, if you have more than one uh, if you have more than one um, hard drive what you guys want to do is you want to uh, first go to the render page and then you want to click browse and then you want to go to your computer and then you want to select the hard drive that has the least amount of memory used on it and what I did I just went to the my backup hard drive and then I just made a file called new video file for Sony Vegas and then I rendered my videos in there and then that gets rid of the issue totally because what that issue that error was basically saying was hey um, there's not enough memory on the hard drive I'm trying to render on so I pretty much cannot render this thing for you so um, but don't fear if you guys only have one hard drive um, or if both of your hard drives or how many hard drives you have are all filled up um, all you have to do is just go to start and then um, just go to computer and then you can go right into the hard drive itself and then um, go into like program files and then what you do is just basically um, literally let you like look around find files that you do not need and then you can just delete them and then get rid of them totally and then free up space for your hard drive and then um, once you have enough room uh, uh, open on your hard drive then you're you're ready to go so um, yeah I, that's really that's really the gist of it um, I hope I helped you guys out uh, this is my first um, tutorial on Sony Vegas, and I'm planning on making many more for you guys. Um, if you guys have any uh, ideas or any other questions or anything about Sony Vegas, um, I'm learning as well. 
but I have learned quite a bit about it and I will try my very best to figure out those issues and make another video for you guys so feel free to comment subscribe I will pop out some more of these videos so um, thank you very much